All right, guys, so in the last video, we talked about the jQuery method of animate, which deals with uh, a custom effect. So in this video, I wanna keep talking about more methods that deal with effects because I wanna give you guys a couple more examples that deal with the transitioning and movement and things rotating and stuff like that. So in this video, we're gonna talk about fade in and possibly fade out if we have enough time. So first things first, let's create an example. Let's create a button. Let's just go ahead and call it button with no class or ID, and we'll call it hosta la Vista. I'm going to close this bad boy out. Let's go ahead and save it. We'll reload it. See if it shows up. There it is. Hostel Visa. Nothing's happening. Business as usual. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to go in here. Let's go ahead and call our jQuery. And let's indicate with our button. And what do we want to do? Well, we want to... When we click on this, we want our function to be... Oh, nope. Uh, now we got to create a, let's go ahead and create a div and we'll just say village park source. Let's close that out again. No class or ID for our div tag, just cause we only have one and that's all we need. So let's go ahead and close this bad boy out. Let me look at my code really quick. Click. Oh, we haven't even put in our, our uh, method yet. So let's go ahead and in here, let's create our caller jQuery and let's call our div. And what do we want to concatenate it onto? Well, we want to go ahead and add the fade out method, just like that. Nope, no zero involved. Sorry about that. And let's go ahead and close this out. Give it a semicolon. Let me look at this. Let's go ahead and save it. Let's go ahead and reload it. Okay, so when we click on this, this should slowly fade out. This should transition out. There it is, just like that. But what if we want to bring it back in? Well, you have to reload it to bring it back in. So let's go ahead and create another button to bring this back in. So let's go ahead and create a button. And this button will go ahead and we give it, I don't know, a class of button. So we need to go ahead and add a dot to the next jQuery that we call it. We'll call it button. Button, whatever. We'll call it button. And we'll say fade back in, please. Let's go ahead and close out our button. We'll save that. Okay, so now let's go ahead, right after our closing tags right here, let's go ahead and create. Let's call our jQuery and let's go ahead and not button, but dot button because we gave it a class down here, just like that. And I use the word button too, again, which is kind of confusing. We'll call it something else. We'll call it second. I don't know. That's just the first thing that came to my mind. We'll call this second right here, just like that. Let's go ahead and click fade in. Make sure you have a camel case. Make sure that I and the O are capitalized. Again, this O keeps showing up. I don't want that. And let's go ahead and close this out now. So we need bracket, parentheses, semicolon. Let's clean up this code a little bit. It's kind of sloppy. We'll go ahead and save it just like that. Let's go ahead and reload it. Fade out. Didn't work. Let's look at our code. How come this didn't work? Do we have sort of semicolons in the wrong spots? Let's go ahead and pull this back. Fade out. That's okay. I'm jumping the gun on you guys big time. We need to go ahead and give it the click function because we're dealing with a button. Call function again. Click. This already doesn't look right. I got this guy backwards. This whole video is just a mess. I'm going to put it out there anyways though because I think this is, I think I'm doing an okay job making it easy to understand. And let's go ahead. Now we'll call our same exact div we're talking about the same div down here in village park source we want to we want to have this disappear and then reappear so we'll call it div let's go ahead and now let's give it our jquery event of fade in close it out just like that let's go ahead and save it now let's reload it hasta la visa bye bye village park source fade back in please there it is, just like that. So make sure you guys have the correct code. Hopefully this made sense. Good luck with this. I'll see you guys in the next video.